Hey Davis Hi, I'm Ryan Tillington and this is Sam Law and welcome back to another episode of BDPN. Today we're talking about the girls basketball team and their run of the playoffs, but first let's talk about some other winter sports programs. Both the men's and women's soccer teams have made playoffs. The women are seeded first and won their first game. They play again on the 23rd. The sixth seeded men's team won in PKs on Tuesday. A truly wild finish. They play McClatchy on Thursday. The men's basketball team came close to their first playoff appearance since 2013 before losing momentum down the stretch. The women's basketball team beat Lincoln 55-54 in their first round of the playoffs with a buzzer beater from Kelsey. Let's go talk to her now. All right, so I'm with playoff hero Kelsey Forrester. So um, Kelsey, tell me about the game winner yesterday. How was that? Um, I mean, it's a winner go home game. Um, that was our mindset coming into it. We really wanted it. We know we had to play. 32 minutes. Um, but I mean, I can't even really remember what happened yesterday. All I remember is they made a layup with like eight seconds left, and I knew I had to get the ball and inbound it. Uh, drove it up the sideline, saw the clock like two seconds, and shot it. And the rest is history, to be honest. Very impressive. So, um, this being your last season, like, how is the season going so far? It's been a great season. I think this season, compared to others, we've just, this is the closest team I've been a part of. Um, and I have three or two of my best, three of my best friends on the team, which I mean makes every day of practice more fun. And uh, winning games with them and spending my last season of high school basketball with them is is great. It's good. So, um, who was like stepped up this year, like that you didn't expect to do so well? Um, I think having Skylar Scouten as a freshman um, oh, yeah. coming into the program, she stepped up huge this year. Uh, Serena Beal has stepped up, Gabby stepped up. I think honestly everyone since the start of the season has improved their game, but someone I've been so surprised with, um, I think Christina has taken the biggest jump out of everyone on the team. So how do you expect to beat Folsom on Thursday night? Uh, so we played them before. Um, wasn't, was a great, wasn't a great season. game? Wasn't a great game, wasn't a great game, but I think they're beatable. I think everyone in this section is beatable. We obviously know we got to play our best, um, but I mean, to be the best, you got to beat the best. Of course, of course. So um, we wish you luck and uh, good luck against Folsom on Thursday. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks everyone for coming in and watching our episode. Um, hope to see you next time. Support Sam and the student staff game and uh, support your fellow Blue Devils in playoffs. See everyone.